In the bankruptcy case of Mr. Miles Gua, Paul Hastings blatantly lied and denied its inextricable relationship with Miles' enemy, the Chinese Communist Party. This conduct has reached contempt of court and is a serious violation of attorney ethics. The CCP's attack on Mr. Miles Gua has been all-encompassing. It has collaborated with the lawyers to falsify the case and replaced the appointed trustee of Miles, who has been under oath, with a pro-CCP trustee, disregarding the Ministry of Justice. The CCP has been trying to lobby U.S. politicians to deport Miles Gua, dedicated to discrediting him, trying to get him to break the rules of the U.S. judicial system. However, Mr. Wangue firmly believes in the impartiality of U.S. law. He fought against the CCP and its agents with truthfulness in 74 cases carefully designed and falsely produced by the CCP, making the CCP break the rules of the U.S. judicial system to commit crimes. It gradually reveals the conspiracy of the CCP's infiltration in the U.S. judicial system and successfully pulls out the chain of hundreds of millions of dollars of interests between them. Mr. Miles Gua has used himself as bait, going through the Rue Ma rape case, the personal bankruptcy case, the SEC investigation of GTV, and other various smears against him. Each case adds weight to the extermination of the CCP by law, shocking the American judicial and political circles. The false shell that the CCP has built up with falsehood and deception will surely be crushed by the truth.